hey guys welcome back to my channel so today is the day after my wash day routine so i ended up setting my hair so i'm just showing you the results i removed the setter so that's how my hair is looking after i remove the setter i'm just using my fingers to run through it and comb out the curls so it's really nice and soft as you guys, as you guys can see you remember i did mention that i am due for relaxer now so i have a lot of new growth so for how it's going to be soft it's the result is really amazing i think that the CPR worked wonders for me um and also you know not to put any heat on it but to actually have my hair in the room has also helped and helps it to shine i already oil it and stuff so i'm just going through it so basically today video you know we're going to do a little hair talk so even though my hair looks okay i am actually going through an extreme chemical damage now for my hair so i'm going to basically have to start changing my hair regime so here you see my hair nice and you know moist shiny look thick however um, the ends of my hair needs to cut as i said i think also i will be changing my relaxer that i am using because i think that's where a lot of the over process of the hair comes from is resulting in the chemical damage and also i think there's some amount of heat damage as well so i will probably well want it I'm actually going to a professional hairdresser to get it relaxed when I'm relaxing again and then also I think I might strip it off you know the product build up because I think I was using a product also that was you know damaging my hair and also causing my hair to break as well so it doesn't look bad now but as I said there's some damage is done the ends need to be clipped you know I probably going to change my relaxer to something that is better because I have my hair is like this it is actually thick but then the scalp is tender so when I use the light cream it actually burns my hair without you know allowing the cream to sit in it so it can process so hence that I think I may switch to the optimum um, no lie relaxer to see how you know it works with my hair also um for wash day i think i can stick with resin it's very good and as i said it's so free so it won't dry my hair also i think i need a deep treatment as well so i'm probably going to do like an oil treatment with the jamaica castor oil that's very good for your hair gives the moisture back to your hair and keep it shiny and everything and you know moisten the scalp and also the organics hair mayonnaise is a good product as well for deep treatment so here you see I'm combing out my hair you see how some the top part is thick and then down to the end it's very thin yeah so that's where the damage is done so that's the part that I'll have to clip so I'm going to have to cut my hair and then start the hair growth um, thing I will be documenting that as well so you guys can you know follow me through the journey of to healthy hair because you know we have a lot of people says that you know black hair can't grow but that's really a myth our hair can really grow i will insert a picture before this with all my hair was before all of this i cut my hair once before this but before my hair was really growing and healthy but then i went swimming and i forgot to wash out the clothing so that had caused my hair to start breaking but i'm definitely going to take on the healthy goat journey and i'll be documenting that for you guys and to show you the process of how it goes you know really starting to try to treat my hair better to see how best that will work out and show you guys as well I'll take you along the journey so i'm just trying to comb it out there as you see the scalp is very moist and stuff and I'm trying to do something. I don't know if I'm gonna get it wrapped or what, but definitely loving the results. So you will see me next time when it's all cut and cream and also treated. All right. Mm -hmm. 